Hello, I'm Ben, yeah. And today I'm going to talk about people that I miss. Um, I mean tonight, it's night. Yeah, I'm, well, I mean. I'm going to talk about people I miss when I was little, okay? So, yeah. So I had this high school that I went to here in Winston-Salem when I was a little kid called, well, not a little kid, but yeah, you know, not a little kid, but I was younger. It's, it was called Triad Academy, okay? And it was on Friedberg Church Road, way down, okay? Yeah, and for... Those friends who are listening to it, I want you to hear this. Yeah, yeah. I really miss those people. I'm going to tell you right now. My mom and dad don't know them. Unfortunately, I haven't seen them in over two decades. Yeah. You probably don't know this, but I cry. I cry. I really cry. I've cried for a decade sporadically from time to time by thinking about them. These people were my friends growing up in school, you know. Everyone has them. But to me, these were special people. They were the greatest people I thought, still think, because I miss them. And I hope and I pray that they are doing well. Since sliced bread, okay? Oh my gosh, and so wouldn't it be nice if I didn't mess up with these people? Yeah, girls too, especially girls, and some guys. Oh, absolutely, yes. But the people that I miss that were once in my life are the names of Austin Holloway. David Beck, and if you're watching this and you have a YouTube account, I want y'all to hear that I miss you guys, and I really wish I could go back in a time machine to 2000, 2004, okay? I'm going to get to the best for last. I miss Sarah McCain, okay? Great, wonderful human being. Chris Dean. What a great guy he was. Um, Scotty King, Brian Burtman, Eric Sims, David Beck, these people, John Smeek, who was my teacher, science, was in my life. I miss him so much. I miss him so much. I just said it. He was a great science teacher. And I hope and pray to God that he's still alive and well. I wish we could all reunite together, you know. And then, I mean, gosh, these people were phenomenal. They were so great. I like them because they were from all over the place and they weren't just from my neighborhood who my mom and dad went to Wake Forest University with, or Carolina for that matter. These were people that we met two decades ago, right, before I went to boarding school, okay, in New York, which you probably have understood that, but these people are incredible. I miss them so much. Alex Van Lu, okay, there was another person I'm sorry my talking quietly. My mom and dad are asleep. But I'm going to tell you. People, these people were great, wonderful. I just, they are smiles. I miss their brightness. I miss this place because I was young. People were young. Everybody was so happy there. You know, it was just great. Wonderful humans. John Momet. He was another teacher. I miss him. Oh, my gosh. 
Mr. Momet, what a great man he was. Priscilla Lang, what a wonderful teacher she was. Oh my God, what a great human. Donna Smith, oh my God, oh my God. It hits me so hard, I just want to cry, but I'm not. But I really miss them. Oh my gosh, what amazing human beings. And, you know, they were great. I miss Dania Hatch. Oh, she was a lovely kid. Nina Patterson, what an awesome girl. Lee Lautman. Well, my dad knows her dad, but yeah. Let me tell you who I miss by far the most of anyone. Grace Nixon and Stephanie Langerak. Oh my gosh, what incredible girls those two were. And they loved me too. They really did. Taylor Mathis, I miss her so much. Hannah Hess, I miss her so much. Thomas Allison, oh my God, what a great kid. God, these people, mm, the best people in the whole world. That's all I got to say. Now, for the past decade, I just had to throw that nostalgia out there. But wow. What awesome people they were, yeah. Sarah Hibbets, oh my gosh. Ben Shamel, he was another one. Jay Mickish, oh my gosh, what an incredible guy he was. Still is. Oh my gosh, I miss these people, OMG, so, so, so much. I, and if any of you heard that, I just wanted you to know I miss you and I cry about you and you probably do because I try to say hello to you but in a professional way I've tried you for 10 years not 10 but a while but you never talk to me ever reply okay that's all I gotta say bye bye